and you have brought out a number of uh, issues, you know, which uh, plague all of us. You know, whenever we move or move out uh, in the society, uh, we 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 find this kind of discomfort, you know, uh, uh, with between generations, right? Now, as a filmmaker, and probably you are a uh, teacher also and a researcher also. I am also the same. So I feel oh that if uh, if by uh, making these films and talking to the people, actually, uh, could we really educate the hard ones like uh, the hard side, so that the children uh, or the victim or sort of those who are in discomfort position, they don't have to play around, you know, uh, to to please the hard ones, the rules and regulations the societies, you know, things of this type. So, is it not our objective or is it not our purpose, goal, that by when we make these films, we, we also help the society in changing, you know, towards better. So, my yeah. goal as a filmmaker is where conversation can happen. If we can think critically, we can get people to think on their own about these issues of gender. You know, I'm not... I don't give a message in my films. And, I mean, if I want to give a message, I would make a public service announcement, and make a documentary. And, and so uh, the goal as a filmmaker for me is really to uh, create a space where you can have a very productive dialogue. And I'll, I'll give you an example. You know, even in the process of making Mardistan and um, uh, Tarun, who was a young uh, engineering student, you can see the change happening as I was asking the questions, right? So he um, comes from a, a, a kind of an upper caste family. He's a, a, a Punjabi from um, um, Ganganagar, uh, Rajasthan. And he has a sister. And for him, the most important thing in his life is he'd been able to leave Ganganagar and come to Chandigarh and have this experience. And this experience really taught him a lot. And the education that he's getting is going to open a lot of doors for him that he wouldn't have been able to open in Ganganagar. And um, what I, when I ask the same, when I ask this question, but what about your sister, you know, who he really loves, he takes care of his sister, he really loves his sister, don't you think he, she is, you know, entitled to the same opportunities that are being given to you? And it's something that he never thought about. And you saw this shift happening in his mind, he's like, that's actually really sad now that I think about it, even though my parents will never let her move to Chandigarh. Um, I also show my films um, you know, about masculinity and gender, and all three of the films I've shown to my students in, in the U.S. And my students, you know, they're much like students here, they have very sort of strong ideas, and and they can relate to it, they can understand, you know, these are the students who are asking stupid questions like, you know, are all Indian men rapists, you know, and so I show them this film and they're able to understand that, oh no, there are, there are these nuances of what it means to be a man, and but many of them, well, the interesting reaction that I get is that, oh, I can relate to that because that has happened to me, or I can relate to that because that's also an issue that is prevalent within my community. And I think that's the most important part, is that you make these films for the purpose of letting them discover knowledge and discover different thinking. You know, otherwise the only option that they have available to them, the only discourse they have available to them, is the songs of Yo-Yo language that is available to you, a guy like Tarun, and that's a really scary thought because then there's a lot of misinformation and lack of knowledge, and that is where I think things go wrong.